Studies on a newly discovered skull dating back 1.8 million years could drastically change the way we understand human evolution. According to the new theory, humanity's early ancestors could have emerged from Africa as a single adventurous species, and not three or more as previously believed. It follows the discovery in 2005 of a fifth skull on the Dominici site in Georgia, an ancient route in the Caucasus for the first human migrations out of Africa. The find has allowed experts in evolution to analyze the physical differences between individuals living in the same place at the same time. They now believe that what they used to consider as anatomical differences are simply differences within the same population. The ancient Menisi inhabitants had legs and feet adapted to long-distance walking, similar to those of modern-day humans, but their hands and arms were similar to those of our tree-dwelling ancestors. Very lucky we have now best evidence of the early Homo presence. And this is most complete skull ever found in the world from this time period. It shows that many features what we thought before are morphological, it's just individual. You can see difference between these two jaws and the first impression is that they could be two different species. But this skull shows that it's just one population. So the Manisi sample is the most complete sample ever found for early Homo population. Excavation work continues at the Manisi site to see if further evidence of early human presence emerges. But more research will be needed to understand how these beings evolved into today's humans before history books can be rewritten.